Welcome to the Dad Got Parks Disney Character Warehouse update for the International Drive location. And this is last year's Halloween pumpkin pillow. Guess they found a cart somewhere. $9.99. I mean, cool. Chewbacca. A terrible Chewbacca impersonation. But I love me some Chewbacca. And a $9.99 Chewbacca Power Force? Yeah. These are collector's pin series, I guess. They're little 18 little figures. They're not pins, they're little figures. The Dejeric figure set. Ah, oh. if it came with the chessboard, I might have considered it. And I could have picked my permanent place on the couch if I came home with it too. But it's super awesome. They always have the cool Star Wars stuff over at International. A shadow box, it's pretty cool. Five by seven shadow box, you put your little picture in there and you got stuff around it. I thought that's pretty neat. They had a bunch of these and they went fast. This is a really expensive Captain Marvel resin statue. There are only 3,000 of them in existence and they were $75.99. Pretty darn cool. I love how there's like a sprite can on the floor right there. Mighty Thor, why was Captain America avoiding Thor? He owed in money. Waka waka. <laughs> that's pretty good. I saw this movie. I thought it was pretty decent. It wasn't the greatest movie in the world, but it wasn't as terrible as everybody said it was. This is the Jungle Cruise game. I love the Jungle Cruise and I love board games, but I don't love $30.99. 10 bucks, I would have bought it. Off with their heads. Super cool sign. This is one of those little desk signs. They're pretty neat. You just stick them on your desk. People don't mess with you because you're going to chop their head off. This is a nice blanket. Really cool. 25 bucks instead of 75. Pretty. There's this whole home stuff here. All this blue and white. Really pretty. Lots of little hidden Mickeys in there. Plates for 15 bucks. There's a serving bowl or dish. There's this planter, candle holder, something or other. I'm gonna go with planter for 11 bucks. Nesting bowls for $34.99 originally, only 16 bucks. Pretty nice. This is that serving tray plate dish thing that I was talking about. It's only $13. And then you can buy your own Disney dishes, seven bucks a dish. If you got a small family, you could have your Disney dishes and it wouldn't be too expensive. This one is really pretty. Um, I would put like pasta in there because I love pasta and I'm Italian. Um, and then they have fake plants in the back that you can have that are really pretty and would match all this blue stuff. And you could just totally theme out your house and your kitchen wares with it. Or you could buy a mountain banshee with roaring action. I tried him and he didn't do anything. There's also no retail price on it. More Chewbacca, $15.99 instead of $35. I have the Boba Fett version of this and they're really nice and detailed. So these are pretty nice uh, figures. He comes with all his accessories. And these are neat, like little starships and they have little stands so you can display them on your desk or whatnot in a very pretty fashion. And they're made by Hot Wheels. That was neat. I was like, ooh, Hot Wheels. I used to have a lot of Hot Wheels as a kid. This was a cool bow. I have the. Have original. you tried blindfolded archery? You don't know what you're missing. Waka waka. <laughs> I have the original Hawkeye version of that one, um, and it's not as cool. Twenty bucks for a giant throw, instead of fifty. A lot of flower and garden stuff in there, which was neat. It's a nice hat. I don't think I could quite pull it off, but maybe the wife. Nice pattern on the underside there. I almost bought this hat, but I have too many hats. But Indiana Jones, snakes, why did it have to be snakes? Love it. I want the real indie hat. That's what I really want. 2022, $5.99. These things are going to be 99 cents because most everybody had already graduated. And what are you going to do? I guess you could tape it or whatnot. Or just hope nobody sees that the name's old or the year's old. $11.99 for dropping beats. Very cool. A Star Wars mug, $6.99, and it's got the Pew Pew. I love the Pew Pew. That's the greatest. Not the greatest handle, but 
better than this handle. Cool mug. Vision, love the Walt quote on there. Um, the handle's just too small. This is adorable. It's Tigger, like a Tigger cake stand. And he's awesome. And then on the top here, it says, Oh, Tigger, where are your manners? Nice. Oh, we have, we're starting to poo eyes our kitchen. Yeah. This thing was heavier than I expected. It's actually like not tin. It's it's ceramic. And it's 20 bucks. Um, but it's heavy. Quite heavy. And a really cool flowery poo. We like the white without the flowers design more than the flower part. Just the... the Plain white poo. Keep it's funny to say poo. And this is the uh, I think America Chavez is the character from Multiverse of Madness. This is her jacket. Really cool jacket. Thirty bucks instead of eighty dollars. It's got all of the embroidery and the pin on there. Nice jacket. Look what I made. That was even I don't know what that that accent was. But Fifteen bucks for this sign. More poo stuff. This is like a laundry hanging thing. I guess it like hangs over the back of your door or something like that. With pockets for storage and such. These are herb markers. So you can stick them in the ground next to whatever your plants are and write on them so you know what's growing in the ground. I like that. We're growing some stuff in our backyard. We have these. We bought them from Shop Disney. I don't know if we paid more than this or not. The wife buys all that stuff on Shop Disney late at night, and I don't know what we pay. There is a laundry basket, I guess, and it's $15. Nesting laundry baskets, you get two. Cute with poo on the side. There's this creature thing, and it's supposed to like shake when you turn it on, but this one didn't have any batteries and I didn't want to try all of them, but that's creepy looking, man. That is creepy looking. 13 bucks if you like creepy. These were May the 4th exclusive pins. Um, they were pretty, you know, hard to get. 18 bucks for $9.99 now. What is Admiral Akbar's least favorite music? Trap. Waka waka. <laughs> I love it. Trap. It's trap. <laughs> Hawkeye pins. These are really cool looking pins. Nice detail on them. For eight bucks. And then we've got the Flower and Garden Festival limited release pin. $7.99 instead of $18. The Hatbox Ghost holding his head. I thought this was a cool pin for $5.99. I don't know what current yellow pricing is, but it's probably not $5.99. I thought that's a nice pin. Madame Leota not really looking like Madame Leota. That's why it's probably five bucks. And I love this Yeti one. That is just an awesome looking, just icon drawing of him. Eight bucks, limited release, nice pin. And this thing is awesome, man. This is one of those pop pins. Huge, $9.99 instead of $24.99. Be happy. This is like a, like a little house and home office type stuff we're going to get into here. They had a bunch of this stuff. $12.99. We have some notepads here with some pencils because you need pencils to write on notes. A journal. And they kind of all are the same theme. A little trinket tray. And this was only $3.99. That was pretty cheap. A Riviera Resort. I don't know if this goes with the set or the colors just matched and they were like, stick it over there. 15 bucks. Because I don't know if that goes with the other set, but it fits. And this is a mouse pad. I wasn't sure what it was at first, but it's a mouse pad with a mouse on it. How ironic. These are the heaviest book. You can see my hand straining to hold them up. Those things weighed a ton for those bookends. You can hold some heavy books. I just thought this was a pretty shirt with Mulan on there and the little tie at the bottom. I thought it was pretty. Some inside out clothing, a little hoodie, 
keeping my feelings inside they just announced that there's an inside out two coming and if you want to learn all kinds of stuff like that tune in wednesdays at 8 p.m to the dad and drew show on the dad and drew show channel where we do all kinds of disney news and tangents and fun stuff this is merchandise we saw over at typhoon lagoon the last time we were there and you can check out that vlog in the description below yeah i'm gonna put it there a stitch mug Actually, it's, it'll be at the end of the video. Just click on that. Nice little handle on this, a solid three finger handle. And these are plastic drinking cups. The last time Chuck Norris surfed the internet, he finished it. Waka waka. <laughs> Chuck Norris joke makes no sense there, but I'll go with it. Nice. Another little plastic drinking bottle, only five bucks. This is a plastic pitcher. I just almost bought it because it was cool. $14.99. They were like $8.99. That probably would have come home with me. I don't know what the heck I would have done with it, but it's cool. These are swizzle sticks. What do you do with swizzle sticks? For like tea? Like stirring honey into tea or something? I don't, I don't know what you swizzle with a stick. That's a swizzle stick. They were only three bucks. $5.99 for the bride from the Haunted Mansion. A non-limited pin though. Keep that in mind. Cool looking though. I also don't know what yellow's current thing is. And then we have this pretty cute little fairy godmother dressy shirt thing. Dress thing, shirt. I don't know. Now it's time for everybody's favorite game show. What did dad buy? Welcome to what did dad buy for the international drive location. Dad did go to both outlets on this little trip. So there's an international video and a Vineland video. If you've watched the Vineland video and you're coming here, welcome. If you haven't watched that one, you can watch that one when this one's over. But lots of cool stuff. International was my uh, first stop. I kind of rope dropped it. I got right in. I was like six or seven, right at 10 o'clock when they open. They've been opening at 10 o'clock now and awesome stuff. So much stuff in there this time that I had not seen before completely new to me. I was really excited and I bought a couple things. The first thing is for my wife and for her desk. It is a Welcome Foolish Mortals desk sign. They were $4.99 instead of $14.99. She wanted it for her desk. The next one is a big brown box. No, there's actually something in here. Hold on. We bought some of the Winnie the Pooh kitchen stuff on Shop Disney when it went on sale and now we have a Winnie the Pooh paper towel holder. I love it. I really do. Um, it's wooden. Um, it comes apart. You could use it as just a little Winnie the Pooh stand. And then you got your paper towel holder on there. I think it's adorable. It has a little, look, a little B at the top there. And then you get Pooh. These were $29.99 normally. I think I paid like $14.99. That's what I'm going with, $14.99. If it's wrong, I'll flash up a different price here after I edit this video. And the last item I bought is all in foam. Let me get my knife out. We have the Spaceship Earth cookie jar, and now we have the Spaceship Earth guacamole bowl. I'm pretty sure that's what they marketed this as. It could be a fruit bowl. It could be an anything bowl. It is absolutely adorable. They were 30 bucks normally. They were, I think, $15.99. I need to check the price on the receipt. Okay, Pooh was $12.99 for the towel holder. And that is listed as a figment PLNTR planter. So it's a planter, it's not a bowl. I guess it's a planter. And the figment planter was $14.99 from the Flower and Garden Festival. The outlets are getting fantastic. Great prices, great selection, new stuff, current stuff. Lots of awesomeness is happening in the outlets right now. So make sure you are subscribed and have your notification bell on. I try to do these at least once a week. I go to both outlets. So sometimes there's two videos if there's enough stuff. There is a second video, so look out for that for this week. I wanna thank all my members. You guys are the best. You can become a member also if you want. The information about joining is below. I give away all kinds of fun stuff. I do one big prize every month. 
Usually it's a lounge fly bag. I think this month it is a set of ornaments, which is pretty cool. So I try to mix it up every once in a while. I give away personal shops. I do all kinds of fun stuff in there. It helps support the channel and I wanna thank each and every member. If you just wanna win free stuff, go ahead and make sure you are subscribed and commenting on videos. When we reach 7,000 subscribers, I will be giving away a Halloween countdown clock. Pretty cool, totally free. Just be subscribed, leave a comment. I'm gonna pick a random video, random comment, random winner. And that's it for this week. Thank you for watching this video. Dad may have a complete mental breakdown and not know what to say, but Dad doesn't do outros, so that's it. Bye. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Maybe check out some of my park vlogs, like where we go to Typhoon Lagoon or we did Mickey's Not So Scary. Lots of fun content on this channel other than the shopping. If you're here for the shopping, there's plenty more of that where that where that's coming from. Yeah, the, the word salad. Never mind. I'm just going to stop rambling and say, uh, yeah, bye.